Best greetings from Kyiv, the capital of Ukraine. My name is Viktor Rufusov and today, 9th day of June 2019, we are sitting today in my kitchen together with my friend and this is very interesting wasp which is just posing for you for this video in our television studio. And who are this wasp? It's quite interesting. If you are interested, stay with us because I will tell you a story about this wasp and how he is big. This was became my pet. Uh, you like probably some of my videos where I show different insects in my hands and I'm talking the story about them. So that's why I'm trying to show them not in collection but really alive. This was be sitting on my finger and just licking not the honey, just the water. I already gave her a little bit honey. She's a little bit nervous because she was spending some time in a plastic jar. But who is that? This is a wasp of the genus Sphex. And this is wasp belonging to the family of digger wasp family Sphecidae. Sphecidae. And this is a wasp cosmopolitan, widely, very wide distribution. And why they are digger wasp? Because they like to digger I try to be not rude, but not cruel, but to put little bit water and honey just to stop her from flying because she is very active. And where did I collect it? I just collected near the forest, but just on a small steps near the railway road because I found some interesting nests just in the ground on just hard inside hard soil in steps near the railroad and near this interesting nest in the soil there were a lot of not a lot maybe few at least two three was where were flying around this nest small holes in the ground and I recognized them these are these was and they belong to the genus Sphex. Very nice digger wasp. Digger wasp. And what we are doing in the soil? Why we are digging the soil? Because we need to catch their prey and bring it to the home inside the nest. I like to put my pets just on my fingers, on my hand to record this video at least now. This wasp is leaking water. At least uh, it's known about 130 different species of Sphex genus all around the world. We have very interesting behavior because inside these holes they have a special stock of captured insects. And who are them? They are just special paralyzed insects and they are either Crickets or grasshoppers? Okay, there are some quite a big, uh, very big size digger wasp in North America, in South America, North America. But this one about three centimeter, not very dangerous. Toxin of the venom is not very dangerous. I can take it in my hands easily and don't afraid about sting. I and I, should I was stung a little bit in my fingers when I collected it because I knew that they were stinging and not very hard. That's why I were very careful and still collected it just for my television studio. Even I will try later to show you the sting of this wasp, how she is stinging. Female need to build several nests. And inside this every of this special whole nest she might bring different prey and this prey this is a special provision provision this was was studied even by Jean Henri Fabers in France and she and he studied how many crickets this wasp will be collecting inside the nest so his first observation was very interesting and of course you can read it in his published books, but he didn't have 
video at this time and now we can show at least this insect not inside near the nest but at least how this wasp is grooming because grooming is very important to clean the body, to clean the wings, antenna for whole life cleaning the body for this digger was is very very important. And after paralyzing the cricket or grasshopper, wasp is bringing it inside the nest, laying the egg on paralyzed insect and larva is developing on this uh, like very well preserved food during the summer and after eating such very valuable food larva is pupating and still and still will be hibernating and inside this hole sorry my dog is becoming active and making special noise this is noise of a dog note of this little wasp Tosha, Tosha, come here! Tosha, come here! Though it's a little bit noisy because I'm recording it at home, not in laboratory. Now, wasp is cleaning, grooming antenna. You can see both sides of head downside. This is too sharp, very sharp. Mandibula or mandibula, yeah, and very narrow, tiny black antenna. Mandibula is very important just to catch the prey in the right position before paralyzing it. Because prey, the cricket or grasshopper is very active and trying to escape. So, after pupation will hatch the adult and adult will hatch from underground, we will emerge underground or just on the next season, on the next spring or summer. So that's why the most part of the life of a larvae will be spent under the ground. And the life of a, this very nice adult just maybe only around one month between May, June or June, July. Depends what period they will hatch from underground. So this is so interesting sphex very interesting wasp and did you see such wasp somewhere near you because they are really different from common social wasp which are black and yellow but this one is usually brown body is very narrow with a very narrow abdomen elongated abdomen on petiolus abdomen and very tiny thin part which is named Petiolus and you see this is the head hairy hands not hands legs <laughs> hands this is not a human my my hairy hand but these are femora tibia and tarsi femora tibia and tarsi femora tibia with spores and tarsi with spores and Tarsi as well, and you see at the four middle and hind legs. Yes, and so this Tosha, come on, come here. And now I can try to show you at least how this was can be active and try to sting because I do not afraid, but still, they need to show you this experiment. What's going on? If you take the wasp somewhere like this, wasp. Ah, little bit stinging. Yeah, she is not becoming not very happy and trying to sting. And you see, you see, see. This is a body. She is becoming noisy. Abdomen with a very tiny sting. Sorry for this little bit rude situation, but I show it just for experiment. 
to show you what's going on. A little bit bigger magnification. Wait, 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 wait. To show you. Yeah, yeah. did you see it sting? Stinging, try, trying to sting. Ah! Yes, I was stung a little bit. Yeah, and my nail. Sorry for this, my behavior. Right, to activate a little bit this was. Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, she's stinging me. Indeed, we can like it. Ah! Okay, anyway, I release her. Okay, thank you for watching. Press like, write your comments, and ask your question. Okay, we release. Sorry about this. My rude behavior with this funny wasp, but at least you recognize her a little bit noise, her voice, and her buzzing. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, and if you have seen this wasp in the field, write your comments, ask your questions. And always will be very happy to see you as my subscriber. Bye bye. I will try to record a little bit here, Roman, as well. Looking forward to see you as my subscriber. Bye bye. <laughs>